Hi there, welcome to my kitchen. So in this video, I'm going to cook our dinner, of course. And guess what? Follow me. Sophie is uh, helping me preparing the dinner, so she's handling the, the knife. <laughs> Let me see. Say hi. What are we going to cook? Salmon. <laughs> yeah, so do it first, and I'll do the rest. And hi again. So I'm gonna prepare all the spice to go with my ginataang hipon. So let me just prepare all the ing the spice, guys. This is how I cook my way of cooking. Prepare everything, and voila! Just show it all there. Here in my little cupboard. This is all where I put my spice. It's my spice. So now I'm going to put all here. This one is the turmeric powder. As always, I always put like a turmeric powder on my cooking. It's most especially if I cook like seafood and uh, with coconut milk. So this one I'm gonna put mixed herb. So just sprinkle it there. Uh, chili powder since I don't have uh, fresh chili and a ground coriander so just shove it there everything in moderation guys in moderation. and then a pinch of parsley so that's it I'm not cooking like curry whatsoever but these are the spice that go with my cooking my ginataang hipon with these guys so i'm going to put like a green leafy vegetables like spinach a leafy coriander and oh and uh bok choy and of course the squash i had this remaining squash left over from last week so i'm going to cook it and this runner beans okay so I have like onions, chop up onions here that my daughter prepared for me. Uh, ginger, sliced ginger, garlic, and uh, chicken cubes. As always, I never lack of having this in my cooking. If you can guess this, this is a tanglad. We call it tanglad back in my countryside. Lemon grass, my goodness me. Chinese lemon grass. And of course, the main is this one coconut massive king prawns isn't it tiger prawns tiger king prawns so now i'm going to reheat just gonna put this on mm. and lock it my cooking my cooker my hob and then to Low heat, low heat. So as always guys, my technique of cooking is I always put the garlic first. Chop of garlic in cool oil, cooking oil. Oh, and I've done with this now. So I'm just going to put it back. Inside. See, when you make some spice, herbs in your cooking you have to make sure it's make sure guys it's not too much because mixing mixed herbs is also not good in your health if you put it too much so in moderation in dosage so yeah it should be and there you go the ginger no. And just cross the chicken cube. Reduce the heat. Fizzles. Okay. 
just a teaspoon of face salt. Okay, so this one, so it's dark soy sauce. Just again a teaspoon. Okay, now, and I'm going to add the uh, color it for like one minute. And guess what my technique guys? I add up a little bit of coconut milk. And hot water. And just cover it one or two minutes. That is boiling now. And I'm gonna add the so I add the lemongrass. Okay. Lemongrass is the key guys. Add some hot water, boiled water. At this point, I've already put the temperature high, so it's going to be boiling and boiling, continually boiling. And the herbs. Remember what I prepared over the spice, I mean, so we're going to add that. And that. And that there. Remember guys, the, the hippon or the prawns it won't take long to cook it so because if you overcook the prawns within the in the shell shell in it go you know uh, hard to to peel it so i'm gonna add more hot you know coconut milk Simmer it for another seconds. At this point, that should already be half cooked. So I'm gonna add tiger prawns now. Yeah. Tiger prawns. Mm. And the coconut milk. And add up hot water. And of course, the black pepper and a little bit of salt to taste. Yeah, cover it and let it simmer for the next one. I'm going to add is these um, beans, runner beans. Why? That has been simmered for now, so that's done. Now I'm gonna add the green, the runner beans, and the green beans at the same time with the lemon leaves. Okay. You go spice and lemongrass, and lemon leaves. When you every time I cook ginata uh, ang or coconut milk with seafoods or prawns, especially prawns. More. I'm gonna simmer it for like one more minute and add. And I will add the green vegetables. Basically, guys, cooking this only takes about six to eight minutes. Not even quite ten minutes, all right? Because the prawns is easily cooked very quick, and the veg. You don't want like um. I don't. Know, it's up to you, but I like my beds crunchy, a little bit crunchy. So now at this point, I'm going to add. Oh, sorry. See that. Now? I didn't cut it because I want it whole. And if you like to cut it, then you can. You have that choice. It's gonna go to this picture. This is what we get. Typically, get if we, we don't have malunggay, if we don't have tinangpong. So, 
That's other leafy, uh, green leafy vegetables. This is the alternate one, the pak choy or the chai. And of course, it, it won't take long to cook. Just drop it there. And in the other side, I'm going to add the spinach. Again, I don't the spinach. You can even eat it raw or fresh. Less than 10 minutes cooking time. Tips guys, to get the nutrients of the vegetables is never overcook it, yeah, never overcook the vegetables. So I'm going to add in the side the spinach. Spinach is very good for your health as well. Uh, I blend the bits, the spinach every morning with avocado and banana and drink it. I mix uh, with the almond nuts, about four almond nuts, Put like uh, barley juice. Okay. So if you want to find out what's the benefits of uh, spinach, you can look it up in the uh, Google it, guys. Google it. Now it's done. So I'm gonna serve that, put that in here in the serving dish. Let me just check. Oh, look at that. I don't know about you guys, but you know, I love my black. <laughs> as always guys cooking it makes me happy because it's food <laughs> it satisfied me how about you let me show you introducing my ginataang hipon with green leafy vegetables and the old bit of calabasa and runner beans <laughs> with lemongrass just delicious so i did again this is it guys i'm going to munch it mm, this is the hippon the tiger prawns mm. Mm. Her up. Mm. 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 So easy to peel like that because you only cook it for less than ten minutes. Mm. Mm, so. mm. Mm, kalabasa. Mm. Let me show my hand. Mm. 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 Happy me! I hope you enjoy watching my cooking program. <laughs> and uh, I'll see you next time. And don't forget to subscribe if you have not subscribed to my channel this is, i mean more i'm gonna be doing more cooking summer is coming guys so stay tuned and thank you for stay uh, for tuning in to max kitchen and there is a story behind it why i love cooking guys because you see i do catering so it's one of my hobby or specialty cooking and I can cook international dish, Filipino dish, Indian dish, <laughs> Italian pasta, and all that, <laughs> British dish, Chinese cooking. So, cheers!